Well, first of all, really a comment about uh, Marin, because obviously a really tough, you've played with injuries to do it on such a, a big court, such a big occasion, it's just so hard to take. It is cruel sometimes, but uh, he fought well and he's a, he's a hero. So uh, congratulations on a wonderful tournament, Marin. And uh, you, should be, uh, you should be really proud. This is the, such a special occasion to play in the finals and you did as good as you could. You had a wonderful tournament and sometimes you just don't feel great in the finals. It's, it's cruel, but uh, be proud of yourself and I hope we can play down the road some, some, some better ones. So. <laughs> Well done. And for you, Roger, a great tournament. It's been a great year since you took that six months off. You just seem to be getting better and better. Got to take more time off. I don't know <laughs> what's going on. I'll be gone again for the next six months. I'm not sure if it's going to work out this fantastic every time I come back. But uh, no, I mean, better than holding the trophy and uh, winning today, I guess, is just being healthy. It's. Uh, um, feels great and it, it means the world to me. We worked so hard, you know, last year. So be back here and, um, you know, just feeling great and holding the trophy now and the tournament that I played, not dropping a set, it's just, it's magical, really. I can't believe it yet. So um, it's just uh, it's too much, really. Now we have to talk records here because you won your first Grand Slam here. Over the years, you've been breaking other champions' records, but now you have your own record, the eighth Wimbledon title, the only man in the history of Wimbledon to ever win it eight times. Yeah, it's... Uh... Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I guess it's... Uh... Again, it's disbelief, you know, that I can uh, achieve... Uh such heights and um, you know I'm, I wasn't sure if I was gonna ever be here again in another finals you know after after last year and I've had some tough ones here losing to, losing to Novak in 14 and 15 but uh, you know I always believed that I could maybe come back and do it again and uh, if you believe you can go you know really really far in your life and I think I did that and I'm happy I kept on believing and dreaming and uh, here I am today with the eights it's fantastic. And I know what it means to you also to play on this court. It means the world to you. And I think the fans, uh, they've shown their appreciation for everything that you've done over the years as well. Yeah, it's the, uh, such a special court. Uh, so many legends have uh, marked this court, uh, the women's game, the men's game, doubles, mixed, you name it, all of it together. So uh, to be here today with Marin and celebrating tennis in a way, it's, uh, so it's very special. And then, of course, um, from day one to finals day, center court's always packed, and we, the players, appreciate that so, so much. So it's a dream to play here, really, and I hope this wasn't my last match, and I hope I can come back next year and try to defend the title. When you won in 2012, your girls were here. Now your boys are here. I know. <laughs> They have no clue what's going on. They think, this is, they think this is probably a nice view and a nice playground, but it's not quite like that here, so one day hopefully they'll understand. But, but it, uh, it's very special. And do your girls enjoy watching you play? Um, they enjoy to watch a little bit. They, they, they come for the finals, I guess. <laughs> but you know, it's, a, it's, a, it's a wonderful moment for, for us as a family and I'd like to thank my team. Everybody's amazing on my team. Congratulations to Marin's team as well. You guys work so hard as well, but uh, this one's for us. And uh, thank you, everybody. Thanks to the family. Thanks to the team. Thank you, Switzerland. Thank you, everybody. And we say thank you to you as well, ladies and gentlemen, Wimbledon champion Roger Federer.